Hi friends, it's teacher Nicole. Today we're going to do a really, really fun activity using some water, some chalk, a butter knife, and some thick piece of paper. I have these cool um, paint samples that are like in the shape of houses or gift tags that I got from Lowe's. These are free and they're really fun. And then this plastic bin or tub that I've used several times in our activities. Now this is the same bin I used for our sensory activity. And I use these all the time. I have quite a few of them that I've bought from the 99 cent store and the dollar store and they come in super handy. So first we're gonna pick our chalk colors. I have some orange, some purple, and some green, and we're gonna put just, and I already did this part, but just put enough water in here that the chalk will float. So first we're gonna choose our first piece of chalk. And we're gonna take the butter knife and we're gonna scrape the chalk like this onto the surface of the water, much like how you would peel a carrot or a potato. Now we're gonna do our second color. Same thing, we're going to just scrape it right onto the top of the water. Very cool. And the next is going to be green. Okay, that looks like that's pretty good. So now we're going to take our paper and we're going to gently turn it to the correct side down. Gently go down into the water and all right, let's see how it went. Whoa, not what I expected at all. Turned out kind of brown, purpley, weird. So here's some other ones that we've done before, me and my daughter did before. There's this one, and there's this one. And then this one is the one that it looks like because it is chalk on paper that if you rub it enough, the chalk will come off. So I clear coated a few of them. So I put a hole in them with some ribbon. And I think they look like cute little gift tags or you can hang them around or you can give them to somebody. Very fun, very cute. Let's do one more since that one fell in the water. Let's do it again. So purple, some green, some more orange, Okay, let's try it again. This time I'll try not to drop it. All right, let's see. Oh yeah, that one turned out great. Very fun, very cool activity. Um, I definitely used it a couple times as a boredom buster for those days that um, there's just nothing to do. And that's it. All right, my friends, have a wonderful day, a wonderful, colorful day. And I'll see you all real soon.